It's among the issues that top Joe Biden's agenda, countering China and its new Silk Road. The U.S. president took advantage of the G7 summit to convince his allies that standing up to China and Russia are complementary objectives, a plan that involves investing heavily in emerging economies. Today, we officially launched the Partnership for Global Infrastructure and Investment. We collectively have dozens of projects already underway around the globe. We aim to mobilize nearly $600 billion from the G7 by 2027. The G7 also maintained a united front in supporting Kyiv, with the leaders of the UK, US, Canada and Japan announcing a ban on Russian gold exports to further hurt Moscow's ability to fund its invasion. With G7 countries, we all share the same goals, to cut the oxygen from Russia's war machine while taking care of our economies and the economies of our partners. Also on the menu of talks is the global food crisis. Leaders pledged to increase efforts to free up much-needed grain supplies that remain blocked in Ukrainian ports. Finally, the leaders will discuss steps to address climate change, a key demand by many activists who've been protesting near the venue.